what's up welcome back to my channel we're doing another week in my life in new york more like a couple days in my life because today's monday and on wednesday i'm going home i'm going to tampa i'm so excited i haven't seen finley i haven't seen my dad i haven't seen my brother since january which is a long time for me it's may like normally i go home every two and a half months three months but no this is a little bit longer than I'd like, but I'm so excited because I'm going home for 10 days for Memorial Day just to be home. My brother moved to his own apartment, so I'm gonna go see that. My grandpa moved closer to us, so there's just a lot. I like need to go home and I'm so excited and Ryan's gonna come towards like the second half of that. Um, he'll like come for Memorial Day and the week after, so I'm really, really excited. But this is also just a really exciting week. <sighs> Tomorrow is the launch day of my collection with Electric Picks. I'm so pumped for that because we've been working on this since October 2023 and it's finally coming to fruition. And then also, I just need to get a water bottle. But on top of that, I'm having my launch event tomorrow at the Plaza Hotel for my collection with Electric Picks. How sick. We're doing a tea at the Plaza, like intimate lunch because I feel like there's so many influencer events and stuff like that now. And I was like, what's an event that would like be something different than just like a little cocktail party so it's like i've always wanted to do tea at the plaza so what better than to celebrate the collection since obviously the collection the promo we surrounded it around being at a hotel so i was like this is so perfect for the hotel danielle vibe a little grown-up eloise at the plaza um but of course it's monday so we got to start off the day with bala bangle bar this is my little workout outfit i'm wearing an aloe set skims tank little brown jacket and today's gonna be a great day. I'm excited. I wanna go to like a coffee shop or somewhere and work. Just have kind of like a me day to prep for the launch event tomorrow. But welcome back. It's a sunny day in New York. Can't complain. I decided not to wash my hair because the event's tomorrow and I'm gonna have to wash it in the morning. So far, I've just used some facial essence, some hyaluronic acid, this one's from The Ordinary, and then I'm starting to use this. We're gonna see how it goes. This is the Revive Skincare Advanced Lip Perioral Serum. When I was getting a facial recently, she said I have a little bit of perior perioral dermatitis. Um, which I've always noticed I have like redness right here So and then I got an email from this brand asking if I want to try the product and I was like this actually is perfect Now we're gonna do some vitamin C. I do have to say I've seen a change in my skin In a good way since using hyaluronic acid serum every day because I wasn't and I didn't realize it was so important because my skin was so dry and I gotta say I think the hyaluronic acid is really helping and then my final step pretty much always is the Skin Fix Triple Lipid Peptide Cream. It's like a barrier cream. I got dressed for the day. Well, kind of. I'm wearing sweatpant jeans, white tee, and then of course the gold jewelry. I'm just gonna get some stuff done around the house. I'm gonna fold some laundry. I kind of just always have a load of laundry going of some sorts. And then um, we're gonna go to a coffee shop or Soho house or something. And I'm just gonna kind of camp out there. I have a lot of computer work I wanna knock out before the next few days. And I'm in the mood to like be in a coffee shop or be somewhere other than my apartment because then I'm more productive too because I'm like, I am here for a reason and we're not leaving until that reason is done. Whereas when I'm home, I'm like, oh, like I'll just go to the bathroom. I'll cook, I'll call a friend, you know, I don't know. It just puts a little bit more pressure, if you will. I'm so excited about my launch event tomorrow. It's like, I think there's gonna be 20 of us total at the Plaza Hotel, what a dream. I made a mood board and everything. It's so funny. I was talking to Emily Billings, one of the influencers coming and she was like, I just know you have a mood board. And I was like, oh my God, I forgot to send it to you. Yes, I do. I just wanted to be chic, like grown up Eloise at the Plaza vibes. Hence like why the launch video was also hotel themed. We wanted to do the photo shoot at the Plaza Hotel, but they weren't down for that. Yet they're down for me to have an influencer event there. So I don't know. We're gonna do the Labo 
Tea Noir, means black tea. Oh, this stuff smells so good. You can smell it from a mile away. It's very specific and it's definitely a little bit more of like a masculine scent, but I really like it. Oh, also actually really quick, while I have you guys, I'm going to be doing a PR giveaway. Um, I've been doing some of these on Instagram and I wanted to do one on YouTube. So I have this huge bag full of products that, you know, I get, I'm very, very lucky. Guys, oh my God, it's so heavy. I'm very, very, very lucky to get so many amazing products from so many great brands, but I simply can't use all those products. Like I can only use so much skincare, so much beauty. Um, so I'm gonna be doing a giveaway. I'm gonna pick two winners to win all of those items in that bag. I'm just gonna kind of split it up in half. It's all really good stuff. So all you have to do to enter is comment down below and let me know what you like to see on my channel, why you follow me. Like, you know, do you like my week in my life vlogs? Do you like the morning routines? Do you like a little bit of everything? Do you like how I've been infusing some fashion? Like I wanna know, I want feedback, what you want more of on my YouTube, just something like that because I'm always trying to improve for you guys, obviously. And if you put your Instagram, then I'll DM you there. Or if you'd rather me email you, whatever best way to contact you if you win. I'll have all the details for the giveaway down below of like when it ends and everything. But yeah, happy commenting. And this is just a thank you for you guys. Um, international giveaway. And yeah, I'm really excited. So comment down below and put your Instagram or your email or however I can contact you to get your address. Okay, got all the stuff I needed to get done here before we head out. My bag is very heavy. I've got my computer in here, charger in case. I've got my planner and I starred the things that have to get done today. I found that really helps my brain to like focus on what's needed to be done. Water bottle, sweater in case I get cold. I'm literally planning for just being there for a while. I, I decided I'm gonna do Soho House, which is annoying because I can't film in there but I'm gonna start with like a coffee and then they have this really good salad. I don't crave salads a lot, like really ever, but when the weather starts to get warmer, I'm like, ooh, I want like a crunchy cold salad. And they have this really good like butter lettuce salad at Soho House, so it's kind of perfect. I can just like sit there all day and I can like order lunch when I want. I can get another coffee. Like it's just, sometimes with coffee shops, it's like they might not have a bathroom. It's kind of rude to be there all day. Like Soho House, you can't make me leave. And there's a roof which it could be fun to sit up there for a second. Ryan might join me to get some work done. I'm not really sure. It's my little fit. I'm wearing my sneakers because I'm gonna walk to meat packing. But I'm excited to like, I love a working day like this where I'm just away from my apartment. I'm excited. So hopefully it's not too crowded and sometimes it's a little chatty. So I hope it's like people are in work mode today. We'll see. Look who it is. I'm in a Soho house. <laughs> we did a little shopping spree for Ryan this weekend and we found this shirt at Old Navy. How good is it? And his new pants? I thought this is blue, but I think it's black. No, it's black. I wanted it to be black. It looks, oh my God, this is gonna be so perfect this summer. I love it. Old Navy has great things right now. Alrighty guys, it's about six o'clock. We were there for hours. I don't even know how many. I think I got there at noon. So long time. I need to go places more to do work because I just got way more done and they just had the best music. It was just jazzy vibes. Everyone there was in work mode, which is nice because sometimes it's more social hour. And it was fun to work with him. I felt like we were back in college, like meeting up to do work. So that was fun. And now we're like, we need to get outside, but like now we're both ready for dinner. <laughs> so we might get more food updates to come, but where are we going now? Uh... West side highway. We're just gonna look at the water really quick. Yeah. Feeling so good, and it's just the most beautiful day, and I love New York. <laughs> just taking a little stroll along Little Island. Such a beautiful day, wow. This is so pretty. I've always said for the longest time that my favorite season is fall, but I was just telling Ryan, I think it might be summer. Like, I just love summer in New York. I love summer in general. It's so happy, you don't have to wear a jacket. We walked to Little Island, then we came right back across the street from Soho House, and we're at Dos Caminos. We actually randomly love this place. It's a chain throughout the city. I don't think they have it in places other than New York, but 
it's really good and it's a lovely day and we love when Ryan's not super busy from work. So we're just having a day. It's so lovely. We're sitting outside in this little triangle part of meatpacking and I'm so happy. Guys, I think I've decided it's so hard to find good queso in New York, aka like the liquidy white kind. And I really think it might be Dos Caminos. This is the Tex-Mex queso dip. If you live in New York and you like, I don't know, in Georgia, like all the places would have this like liquidy and I just miss it. And I think this might be the best one. Ryan's ready. To <laughs> I have so many videos of you just like ready to go. Chicken tacos, yummy. Got the jazz going. Oh, it's so lovely. I wish I used to have a Himalayan salt nightlight and I would take showers. With that, maybe I'll take a shower with this instead. It's not really mood lighting, but maybe it's a little better. I have a spray tan from last week and it's still really, really nice, honestly. And I don't, I didn't want to get a fresh spray tan. I didn't want to do a full self tan moment tomorrow because Wednesday I go to Florida and I'm just going to scrub everything off and just lay in the sun. But I did want to touch up because the dress I'm wearing tomorrow is like a plunge, not plunge, but it's like a lower neckline and my arms are out. So I use this stuff. This stuff is amazing. I hope it's still available. This is the Tan Lux Airbrush 360 Self Tan Mist. And this is the Club with Paris Hilton. It is the best self tan I've used because it literally is like a micro mist. And then I just use mitt and blend it all in. And the tan is so nice. It's like the darkest color they've made. And it's so nice. So I just use it. I just use it on my chest and my arms. So we're gonna hoop and pray. Cause normally I do my full body, but like my spray tan is pretty good except for right here. I don't know. Just putzing around, doing some things, got my robe on, listening to my jazz still. Good vibes. One of the best purchases is this little thermal printer. I got it on Amazon, it's so small, cause obviously I would love to have a full size printer, but I have nowhere to really put it. Um, but I got this, you can put one piece of paper in at a time. It doesn't take ink and you can't do anything other than black and white. Like it won't print color, but it's so cool. It uses special paper and you can't do double-sided. It's very simple. I basically got it to print return labels because that's pretty much all I need a printer for. And every now and then I need to print other stuff. So it's so nice to have, but I can't wait to one day have a place where I have a specific printer area. But I got this on Amazon. Just look up thermal printer. I guess it like prints... I don't understand the science behind it, but this paper picks up on it. Like I don't have to put ink in it ever. You just plug it right into your computer. So I am currently printing a shipping label, hence why this is all out, but I thought I'd shout it out. I think I've talked about it once before, but it's so cool. I'll show you guys. Okay, so you hold down. It kind of takes in the paper a little bit and now I'm going to print this. And here it goes. So it just takes it and it prints it out the other side. You just have to connect it to your computer. There might be a way to do it uh, Bluetooth, I think, too. But I just use the cord, it's easier. Amazing. And there we go. On the other side of this is my shipping label. We are settling down. I'm gonna make some hot tea. In a second and wind down now. Take some melatonin, that vibe. I wanna watch some TV. I'm trying to decide if I wanna watch Sex in the City, The OC, or Netflix is showing me an ad for a simple favor. I didn't realize it was on Netflix. It's the movie with Anna Kendrick and, isn't this Blake Lively in here? Blake Lively and Anna Kendrick, but it's a thriller. Actually, no, I'm not gonna do that right now. So I'm either, I just started The OC last weekend because my friend Caitlin was like, you know, I can't believe you haven't seen this before. I just started it. It's like Gossip Girl, but in California, I think I'm gonna watch that right now. And then I'm rewatching Sex and the City for like the fourth time, but maybe I'll put on a little OC and then go to bed. I'm obsessed with the show. It's on Hulu and it truly is Gossip Girl on the West Coast in like Orange County. It's really entertaining. It definitely gets like heavy at points and makes me sad. So sometimes I'm like, I just need to put on like Sex and the City or something, but it's good. So I'll resume that. I'm on episode six, season one. It's so funny, the main guy's name is Ryan. So I'm gonna watch that. And then normally I do my planner in the morning, but I'm gonna do my planner for tomorrow, tonight. So when I wake up, it's done and I know how my day's looking.
Good morning. It's launch day. I washed my hair extensions this weekend because I haven't washed them in so long and they smell so good. I used the Pantene shampoo and conditioner. Oh my gosh, they literally smell so good. Um, but I'm just laying them out because we're getting glam today. We're doing hair and makeup. I think I know what hair look I'm going for. Um, and Jackie, who does my hair. If I ever get my hair done in this capacity, Jackie's been doing it. And then Kat is doing my makeup. I'm so excited. I'm like nervous, but I'm like, I like, no, let's just enjoy today. Today's launch day. That's exciting. There's no reason to be nervous. So I use the Luxie Seamless Hair Extensions. These are the blonde balayage ones, I believe. And then I pulled out my black ribbon because I think we're gonna infuse that in there. Cheers. This is the hair I think I'm going for. Similar to what I did at my photo shoot for this in the black dress, but instead of like the big black bow that I wore, we're gonna do this ribbon. Um, my hairstylist sent a couple options. This was another idea, and then this was another idea, but I liked like the Bardot vibes of this one, a little bump it moment, if you will, and then I had the black ribbon, and then that way you can still see the earrings. I think that's gonna be so nice. So this is the look I did. I'm so excited because we're posting the final launch video today too. I need to like gua sha or ice roll or something right now before they get here. So it's it actually is pretty similar to the hair I did for the shoot, but we used like a real bow. So this will be a ribbon and I think we'll use less hair on the front as well to like change it up, but I'm so excited. I'm gonna grab my ice roller. I always have to do this a couple times so it's not freezing cold when it hits my face. The plaza event starts at 11 a.m. And then from there, we'll be there for like two hours. I'm so excited to go to the plaza hotel. Like, that's also amazing. I'm getting there a little bit earlier before everyone else to make sure everything's good, take pictures with the team, all of that. And then I'll come back and I have the rest of the afternoon to myself to pack for Florida decompress, recharge my social battery. I'm gonna see Ryan tonight because I'm going home and then he'll come this weekend to Tampa, which I'm excited about. I'm so excited to see Finley. I'm so excited for today. There's so much excitement ahead. Just finished ice rolling and now we are going all hands on deck for de-puffing. Um, I put some face oil on my face and now I'm using this tool. It like vibrates, but also helps with puffing so hopefully this works all right we've got the kit the cat the jackie with her <laughs> extensions in i'm so excited big day what are we doing now oh is it eyes you're like yeah. this is not a good time your eyes. <laughs> you're like let's close our eyes but it, guys it's a beautiful sunny day which is always what you want like rain just wouldn't be fun today mm -hmm. and we're all drinking our smoothies we all got our juice generation that's kind of our tradition at this point it is. Um, I like only have it with you now. Really? It's kind of our thing. I have, I've really only had it with you recently too. I got the OPP as always. Aww. Kat got the PB and Joe. And Jackie got, what is it? The cherry, what is cherry? It's like a dragon fruit cherry. Oh yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Sounds Very yummy. Nice. So that's what we're doing here. Guys, this is the final look actually. Hair and rollers <laughs> the bow. <laughs> I love it, it's so funny. Tay Noir, the Lavo. Got the fit on. Thank you for my lip. I like the lip. So we didn't do gloss, it was just. I did put a little gloss on top. I'll bring. Mm -hmm. Got the jewels on. Guys, so cute. They just stopped by and brought decaf coffee with my name on it, the Electric Picks collab, and bagels. Like, how thoughtful. Okay, here's the final look. We're about to head to the plaza. So we've got some little black heels on, some sheer tights. Dress is House of CB. I absolutely love it. Got the Luxie hair extensions in, a little bow, Jackie crush. Makeup, we just did like a soft, everyday glam, a little sparkle on the eye. And the bracelet, the three necklaces, earrings, and I think the collection's live now, so. <laughs>
so coming on this much every day seriously for giving this opportunity. It was like such a dream come true. Like when this happened, I was so excited. And seriously, she and her amazing team who are all here to yell at too really allowed me to they were like, okay, you want to do Star Wars Let's do it. Like there was no like I was like, I need the montage. She's like, yeah, like there was no like, oh you actually can't do that, which I really, really appreciate because like I wanted to be something genuine that I wanted to wear and hopefully that you guys want to wear too. And to my team, Ash and Teddy, you guys have been here and Lucy too and wherever she is. Um I just really appreciate each and every one of you. So thank you so much. Let's enjoy tea time at the plaza. <laughs> We did it, we did it. And we are home now and I'm just like sitting here in my dress. I felt so at home at the Plaza Hotel in my little Eloise outfit and then like walking down my street, walking into my apartment, everyone's like, why is this girl walking around holding a bouquet of flowers and in like a little dress? But it's okay, I'm so glad the weather's so nice today. It's just been the most lovely day. I'm gonna put you guys here. I know it's annoying with the pillow. Maybe that's actually kind of annoying. Today was so fun. I'm just so grateful. Like there's just so many amazing people in my life and so many girls I actually went and did two bangles on my wrist and I actually really like this look it's a it's a nice vibe it went by so fast I guess that's good like everyone's having fun it was just so cute looking around everyone's like in their little Sunday best drinking tea and champagne I had a couple sips I was like who am I like I'm not even a big champagne girl these days I love champagne the way it tastes but I just have been like a vodka girl as we know, but I was just like drinking champagne. Everyone was just in the best mood and the plaza was so beautiful and I just felt like a little Eloise. So I'm so grateful and now I like literally haven't even looked at my phone, but obviously the collection's live now and I'm so excited to hear how it's going and how if everyone, I got, I've gotten messages like, just bought the Montauk earrings, just bought the Carolyn necklace. It's so interesting seeing like what people are, gravitated towards and I'm so excited to go to Florida tomorrow and wear my aquamarine Montauk earrings all week long so just feeling very grateful and it's of course like the most beautiful sunny day and all I want to do is just like veg out well I do need to pack obviously um, but a part of me is like it's so nice out maybe I go for a walk later the world is my oyster, but also like, do I keep the glam on? I gotta take the bow out of my hair though. That's simply, I think I'll take this part out and like fix up the hair, but I think I'll leave my extensions in. Why not? Ryan and I talked about maybe getting dinner because he was like, you're gonna be all dressed up. I was like, you're right. Not that I would wear that, so I'll probably change, but I got so many compliments on the dress and I'm just feeling really grateful. And that's just the little event recap. But now um, I honestly barely ate or drank there because I was walking around talking to everyone at the table because you know, that's the thing with like a seated event is you know, I wanted everyone there for a reason. So I wanted to be able to talk to everybody. So I was like, you know, standing around. I didn't pee for so long, um, but the tea was so lovely. Everyone's like, wow, the tea is hitting right now. I was like, I know. Um, and then we all got this beautiful bouquet. Um, I'm only here for a day, but I'm going to enjoy them. I actually saw on Margo Lee's story this morning, Someone left a bouquet of flowers at her door and said, please adult my flowers. I'm traveling Which I thought was so cute. Basically like they had a bouquet of flowers. They were traveling. They're gonna die So I gave them to Margo kind of like 
feel free to not take care of them. It's not a plant, you just put them in water, but I thought that was a really cute idea. It's kind of spreading the love. So maybe I'll do that to my next door neighbor because these are so gorgeous and my neighbor helps me out sometimes and she's so nice. So um, this is like from a florist, like this is a good bouquet. And then on each bouquet, everyone loved this. We had the Montauk earrings clipped on the back. So very obsessed, very happy. But I think now I'm literally gonna make another decaf coffee and put on sweats and just sit and like go on my phone and look at all the content we took and like I just changed already. I'm in our OG Hamptons gals merch. My door on my calls and she's like, so I have a package and it's like not a package. And guys, it says happy EP collab launch day. Congrats, this is so exciting. So proud of you for your accomplishing all your dreams. Wish I could be there to celebrate with you. XOXO from Italy with love, Brooke. And they're beautiful peonies, guys. I wish I wasn't leaving tomorrow. I didn't even think about fact that people might get me no there's like water in here okay well look how beautiful these are stunning peonies i am not these are not good these are <laughs> should i just bring them to tampa that's so nice i'm sorry these are the most stunning peonies i've ever seen brooke i'm not okay i forgot how much i love peonies they must be in season right now i'm seeing them at like this florist I go to a lot because they have a coffee shop there and I've been seeing a lot of peonies. They must be in bloom or whatever. Uploading tomorrow's Gals on the Go YouTube video and I am ordered a salad from Chipotle. I always get chicken, lettuce, obviously, mild salsa. I started adding guac recently because I was like, why am I not doing that? Black beans and that's kind of it. Pretty boring, but it's so good. <sighs> Candles are blown out because we are leaving. Changed into a little walking outfit. I love the hair extensions though because they're just kind of giving, honestly. Packed for Florida, yeah, I'm bringing two suitcases, but like my mom asked me to bring her some boots. I'm bringing a pool float to the house that I got in PR, and I'm sure I'm gonna shop at International Mall while I'm home, home. <laughs> so I just wanted some room. So we're bringing two suitcases, who's surprised? I'm going for 10 days, you know? Wait, this is a funny angle. I'm just putting in some little hoop earrings because I felt naked. I just put some barrier cream on my face. Guys, I am so full from that Chipotle. I didn't even finish it all, but like, I don't know what it is. Nothing else does this to me, but Chipotle just makes me feel like I have a rock in my stomach, but like, I will continue to eat it because I love it so much. I don't even know, but we are gonna go for a walk. I'm gonna make some pit stops along the way. I think I might go stop at my friend Morgan's apartment, but she hasn't responded yet, so I don't know. And then I'm gonna go see Kat, cause she is over in the West Village right now. I'm gonna go say hi to her, and then I'm gonna hopefully make my way over to West Side Highway. So that's kind of the goal. I just wanna get outside. I'm done packing, I'm done with my work for the day. It's been such a special day. I just wanna like put in my earbuds and reflect and just be all sappy and just like one more. <laughs> I'm literally acting like I'm going on summer break. Like I'm going home for the summer. No, I'm going home for 10 days. But you know, one last little city hurrah. It's just the most beautiful day and I've been inside packing. So I wanna go outside and it's like golden hour. It's so pretty. So. We're gonna go do that and also gotta show off the hair. I already took off my makeup though. I needed to wash my face, but you know, it's still nice. And I'm excited because I'm not gonna wear a jacket because I don't need one because I think it's finally summer in New York, I think. I just simply needed a sweet treat. I mean, we had a big day, so Ryan got me a cookie. I'm so excited. I love Chip City so much. And I actually liked Crumble the other day too when we got it. I've officially hit 10,000 steps. Woo, woo We did it once again, and we're getting a few more steps because Ryan now wants to go to Chipotle, which is so funny, obviously, because I had Chipotle, but I have a little bit left over, so if I get hungry, we can eat Chipotle together. Meredith 
Blake. No, I'm kidding. I'm headed to the dentist. <laughs> but it's Thursday morning. We're here in Tampa. And I just had to show you guys my cute little dress. It's workout material. It's from Abercrombie. I think they also have it in like a linen version. But I'm obsessed. I have the Avenue necklace on. The Danielle bangle. Little hoops. I just got these YSL sunglasses because I'm obsessed with sunglasses, as you guys know. Some white sneakers, little Freya bag. We're gonna go to the dentist and hopefully only get good news. <laughs> and then go to Target or Ulta because there's just some things that I want to have here and then I just don't have to pack them. Um, I do this every now and then. I go get stuff that, like shampoo, stuff that I want here. Like I need more Bondi Boost here, stuff like that. So let's go. Alrighty, appointment was actually so easy. Teeth are looking good. I literally love my dentist so much. Every time I see him, I'm reminded why I still go here in Tampa because he's just such a peaceful, calming presence and he just gets the vibes. So I left with three of my fluoride toothpaste, prescription toothpaste, that's me. Um, I don't know if it's actually a prescription, but someone said that one time and I was like, yeah, I have prescription toothpaste. It's not a flex by any means. I have very weak teeth. Um, okay, feeling good. Apparently I'm not allowed to drink for 30 minutes. Eat or drink for 30 minutes because I have fluoride. Hot take, I actually like fluoride. Like, I like the taste on my teeth. I don't know. Um, okay, Ulta Target, Ulta Target. I think they're in the same plaza. I don't know. We have decided on Target because I also realized I wanted to make cowboy caviar. It's such a cool, good snack to have poolside. Um, it's basically like black beans, pinto beans. Um, I have the recipe on my phone. Cilantro, tomatoes, corn. It's, uh, it's so good. And you dip tortilla chips in it or whatever vessel you'd like to dip it in. It's so good. So I came to Target. Maybe I also kind of want to buy a, sh a pair of short sleeve pajamas to keep here. Just stuff like that. So we're going to go to Target, as the people call it. Um, just going to live my little suburb life going to Target. And then I did want to get a workout in. I did take Finley for a long walk this morning. But I could do more for sure. I am getting the most random things. Goggles, of course. Bathing suit. Now I'm looking at the pajamas. Are these short? Yes. These are perfect. They're linen too. This is the most elite thing. Target and Starbucks. Obsessed. It's so hot. We got chips for the dip. They didn't have enough of the ingredients for cowboy caviar. So I'm just going to go to Publix. And then that works out because I can get a wrap from the deli. I got all kinds of products. I got a football so we can pass it around. I'm really excited about this hat, just for tanning purposes and I'll leave it here. And I got some dental stuff. I got so much sunscreen. I got a new Philips Sonicare. These are great for travel. I literally got like five different types of sunscreen because it's so necessary here. I got a coffee, I got an iced latte. And the barista at Starbucks who was making my coffee, she was like, wait, are you Danielle? I was like, yeah. She's like, I'm Tatum. I've been watching your videos forever. I, was, I love you. So thanks for saying hi. You made my day. We need to get back. The sun is sunning, but I want to go to Publix first. Oh my God, that Starbucks is so good. Hello everybody. We're back now and I just drank the corn. I'm just putting everything in for caviar. Cowboy caviar. I love cowboy caviar because it's so low lift. You just get all these canned goods. I have a highlight on my Instagram. You kind of have to scroll, but I have an Instagram story highlight called cowboy caviar with my like the recipe my family always uses. Ooh. So yeah, I basically just put everything together that's in there. It's like tomatoes, onions, cilantro, garlic, black beans, black eyed peas, corn. I double up the recipe because like we're going to be by the pool all weekend and there's going to be a lot of people here. Um, and lime juice, and then you use the good seasons, like Italian dressings. I don't know if it's Italian dressing, but the good seasons, you mix it. It's like that dressing with vinegar and olive oil. I don't know if I'm making sense. And then you put that on, and then you let it like soak. I like, like to put it in the fridge for a couple hours before I eat it. So that's why I want to get it made now, so we have it for the weekend. It's so good. Like, sometimes I just eat it for lunch or chips. It's so filling because it has all the beans and the corn and I'm chopping up cilantro right now and I was just thinking my hearts go out to the people that cilantro tastes like soap to them. I know that's like a genetic thing because I love cilantro so much. 
and it just makes me so happy. I'm trying to chop it down really finely. It smells so good. I just chopped up so much garlic too, which was very tedious, but it'll be worth it. My family better just love me for this. This is taking longer than I wanted, but it's gonna be so good. Ta-da, it's done and it's ginormous. Like this better last us for the next 10 days that I'm here, seriously. It's so good and then you just dip your scoops in there and it's the best, but it's best to put this in the fridge for like two hours to let it chill. So I'm going to do that. It's about 2.30, I need to go get my bathing suit on. I got a new bathing suit from Target that maybe I'll put on right now. Okay, enough stirring, there's not much else to do. I just put the dressing on it. So now it's all good. Finley is just dying to go outside. I have to put on my bathing suit and then we'll go play, okay? How cute is this swimsuit? It's from Target. It's like a little yellow paisley print. It looks like a bandana. And I just thought it was fun. And this, I'll just like keep this here. I always buy things to keep in Florida and then I'm like, come up to New York. No, but actually I'm gonna leave this here. This is my favorite type of swimsuit to wear when I'm tanning. It's just like, Perfect neckline, everything. It's not like too crazy of a tan line, just a little triangle shaped bikini. So we're gonna go outside, hang out, chill with Finley, read, you know the drill. Came in, guys, we got some color. Showered, put on a little sundress, the best feeling ever. I'm gonna go to dinner tonight with my mom and my brother in St. Pete, so I'm excited. I don't go to St. Pete a lot, so we're gonna have some fun. This dress is from Show Me Your Mimu. I absolutely love it. Um, I also unpacked last night. Like, I literally took everything out. I put everything in my closet here just because it's, I feel more whole. I feel more, like, organized. My sunglasses. This is an amazing thing from Amazon. My belts. All my jewelry. And, yeah, I'm going to end this vlog here because, like, it started in New York. Now we're here. And I need to start a new Florida vlog. So, I love you guys so much. There'll be more Tampa content in the next video. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.